let's get cracking. Um, so it's not quite constrained, but it is a bit constrained. Uh, the 14 clear is also, that's a very low total for such a long, that's another eight cell diagonal of So here we could put one and two in those squares. That would give us uh, three lots of three is nine or 10, 11. So we've also got three, three degrees of freedom here. Oh, but I, ah, that's quite nice, yeah. Um, yeah, I made a mistake in a way. When I said these could all be ones and twos, well, they can't be. Why not? Well, because we have a diagonal constraint. So if I put the number one, for example, in all three of these boxes off the diagonal, I now cannot put a one on this diagonal, so that is not going to work. So actually, the maximum number of ones I can have along this string. Well, I can have ones here and here always. Let me just write those in. So if I have ones here and here, I can have one one. I can have, I can have two more ones along this string, but only a maximum of two more ones. So the third one we've already looked at kills the diagonal, and it's the same for two. So I can have, I can have one one and two, sorry, two ones and two twos. Ah, and if I have two threes, that gives me 14. Good grief, so I have... Right, this is gonna... So, so we definitely have this pattern. Just think about this for a moment. This is playing with my head. So, this is one and two. Yeah, so they all have to be different. Whatever pairs we make up in these three boxes, I can't repeat a pair because if I did, if I had a one and three here and a one and three here, because I need two twos along this string, I'd end up with two twos here and that doesn't work. So in fact, these, these pairs are, are the pairs one, two, one and three, and two and three in an order we have no clue about, but that is what we need to do in order to make sure that there's always a box we can put the one, two, and three on the diagonal on. Good grief, okay. So this 66 clue is gonna work the same way, isn't it? So if I can't put, if I can only put two nines and two eights along it, then I could, I could have nine, eight, seven, twice, so that's 24, 48, plus two lots of nine is 66, good grief, right, okay, so we've got sevens, eights, and nines into those squares, but a similar restriction, but the opposite restriction.